<laughs> All right, so we're back to the only subreddit for being a brainless moron can get you laid. It's r slash furry IRL. More stupid sexy people, damn it. All right, so there's gonna be a bit of a announcement here uh, if you have the time to listen to it before we get to some very fun memes for tonight's video. I am currently looking for a job. What does this mean? Well, the uploads are gonna get unfrequent. Like, I won't be able to upload every day now. Uh, that pretty much that's the reason why uh, I haven't been uploading every day constantly for the past month or so. Like part of the reason why I'm trying to get a job now, it's because I, I'm i starting to get burnt out on YouTube and it's not good for me mentally and physically. YouTube is not paying me as much anymore and the algorithm still isn't working for me. Uh, so um, yeah, I'm trying to find a job now. Uh, I just did an interview a few, a few hours ago and now I'm waiting a call from them. If they did not, if, if they do not call back, then I guess I'm back at it with the uh, with finding a job on the internet. Yeah. What would this mean for the channel? Well, don't worry, it's not gonna go away, right? I still love YouTube, I'm just burnt out. I need a new perspective, I need a new way to like live my life instead of just living in my very small, very, very crazy like room of the Hello Kitties. But yeah, looking for a job, things are gonna change. That's it. We're gonna go, go look at memes now. <laughs> I've only seen Digimon Adventure 1. I've only seen Digimon Poor. <laughs> uh, I feel like I feel like you step you missed a step here, okay? Uh, the first steps is like watch Digimon Adventure first and then gradually make your way up into the other seasons, the other reboots, the remakes, everything, and then you get into Digimon Porn. <laughs> <laughs> Far be it for me to tell you what to do with your time or when and how you're gonna watch Digimon and all, but if you saw the porn first, you're gonna get very confused when Digimon Tamers comes around. Oh no, my smartphone is broken. Too heavy. Yeah, I'm crying. Uh, broken smartphone. Yeah. I pride myself in being a very responsible cell phone owner, okay? Not once have I dropped my cell phone. Not once have I broken a cell phone's screen. I understand the value of a smartphone and that they do not grow on trees, that you have to work for them. And if once you obtain one, you buy one with your hard earned money, you grab onto it, right? You grab onto it like a little tiny baby mouse and do not let it drop from your grasp. I'm proud to identify as morosexual. I'm attracted to dumbasses and dumbasses exclusively. A guy asked me what the Spanish word for tortilla was, and now I dream of kissing him under the moonlight. The same idiot. Hey, uh, Louie, what kind of animal is the Pink Panther? Oh, Legrishi, you're so freaking stupid. <laughs> I kind of wish morosexual was like a thing when I was in high school. Like, I wasn't like, uh, a stupid person or anything but men but when math and algebra came along that's when i started to lose brain cells you would think me being a dumbass at math and algebra would have gotten me like a relationship by now but no um all it got me was shame and failure if i were born into a chinese a very strict chinese family i would have been disowned i have 125 lawsuits against you or against other people because if you have 125 lawsuits against other people i want to know if one of those people is the person that created you you have a toothpick for a leg and you are roughly in the shape of a toucan a hamburger and a pair of bananas that got into a very very dangerous car accident but before we get into any more memes for today's video let's go check out our patreon shout outs we got Fox Demon, Whisper Whisper, Carapini, Keo Plays, Anti Thesis, Leon Pharma, Voltage, Benjamin Wilson, PO Creations, Werewolf Detective Paw, Gurgly T Gurgly, also known as Gary T, 845, Mad Scientist, The Unknown Fluff, Nate Pope, Luna Snowball EP, and a very, very new member of the Patreon family who is a fellow bear like me, Bear Kemi. I really hope I'm pronouncing your name wrong. <laughs> 
name right. God damn it. Uh, thank you guys so much uh, for continuing to be my patrons and of course the newcomers for choosing to subscribe to my Patreon. It helps me a lot during this very kind of trying time in my life right now. And if you guys want to help me through this trying time of my life right now, you might want to go down to the description uh, where I have included the link tree. Yeah, I made a link tree for all of my socials and all of my donation pages and for the Patreon, of course. It's all in there. Go down there, go down there and click on it and subscribe to the Twitters and all of it, all of that good stuff. Go do that. But especially, don't forget to um, subscribe to the Patreon. That is very, very much important. Let's go back to the memes. This is the ideal male body. You may not like it, but this is what peak performance looks like. Yeah, I mean, for a nurse, yeah, I would I would hope so that they're that they are in peak performance. Being a nurse is a very, very serious job. Because if you're a nurse and you are not in peak performance and you're not that efficient when it comes to your job, people are gonna die. A genuine thank you. Good job overnighting my six colored and shaded art commissions with detailed backgrounds for me without any payment up front. I hope you appreciate this. Yeah, bitch, I didn't draw this for free. Now bend over. You know what? You know what? If I'm being honest, I would absolutely bottom for you if you gave me free art. I will keep my back entrance clean and tight and full of flesh for you if you draw me a picture of Diane Foxington and Mr. Wolf making out under the moonlight. And no, you are not allowed to think that I'm weird for saying that. Mm -hmm. No bear flare. Yeah, can we like talk about this? Can we talk about this like for a minute or so? For IRL, why do you not have a, a bear flare? Do you have any idea how hard it is for me to like dig through piles of piles of crap to just find a good bear meme in this subreddit? I mean, yeah, sure, I could filter it with words association. Like, I could, like, put bara on the search bar and it'll show me what I want. But it's not quite the precise thing that I want. And it offends me that there is not an accommodation for my furry species. I am offended. I identify as the bear skin rug that you find in a ca in the log cabin somewhere in Utah. You will respect it, or I will write a Tumblr article about you. I, uh, P.S. This is very much satire. I am not angry at r slash furry IRL because they don't have a bear flare. This is all satire. Please don't fucking cancel me. Forced to wear a maid outfit. This actually feels comfortable. But frick you! Now for me, I never had the courage to wear uh, a skirt because... I look ugly in a skirt. <laughs> also, the uh, Scotsmans, the Scottish, they have been doing it right all along that men should wear a skirt. But here's a little warning, laddie. Never ever call a kilt a skirt in front of a Scotsman, because that's exactly how you die within the hands of a Scotsman. Well, for the first offense, we'll basically just beat you to a pulp, but if you do it a second time, we will definitely kill ye. And that brings us to the end of our slash furry IRL. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. Like, subscribe, all that jazz. Follow me on Twitter, chat with me on Discord, support me on Patreon, support me on Coffee, and don't forget to check me out on TikTok. I have a thousand plus followers on there now. Please, I know the goal for 2000 before the end of July is not coming true, but can we at least get to 1500 before the end of July? It's not a huge request, you know. <laughs> uh, that's it. Hope you guys enjoyed. And this has been your fellow Degenerate Cook Boss 88. And I'll be seeing you guys again in the next video. Stay foxy. Much love.